sure my camera stays. All right. I am so sorry for whispering in all my vlogs. I, my parents are still in my house, and uh, I don't want them to think I'm a crazy person talking to a camera. But that's fine. Because Melissa Monday, your house is beautiful. I wish I had a house like that. You know how awesome it would be to have a skating rink in your house? Oh my god. Anyway, so, um, I have a couple things that I want to talk about. I have my little note card. Um, the question of the week was, what kind of potion or spell would you make if you had the ability? And Melissa said she would, um, have to make a potion to stop time, which I thought was really cool. Because, just like her, I'm a bookworm. And I would want to read all the books in the library and just devour them all. Ooh, my camera's shaking. Um. And so I, that got me thinking, and my potion would be, going along kind of with the knowledge and books, would be the ability to retain whatever is said or wh whatever you read. Because I think I, be, and as a musician, to be able to hear something and then be able to play it would be awesome. And also, because I don't really get everything that my teacher tells me about chords and voicing them and all that. It'd be nice to just hear it and understand it. And so that's what that's what I was thinking about. The the ability to retain instantly what is said to you. Uh, going on, Melissa, I love your family. Oh my gosh, they're beautiful. Uh, they're beautiful, they're wonderful, they're happy, they make me happy and my family's from Torino. We have a bunch of people like that too. So it makes me so, it's actually like full of hope for the future, that all these happy people and happy family, rather than all this violent that we, violence that we hear all the time. It's really good to see that. And it's so wonderful. I love seeing all these really happy faces and beautiful people and it just makes me happy. Um, Susie Tuesday, your vlog made me cry. Oh my god. Everything you said about being thankful and reflecting on the Harry Potter fan, and not only that, but in your life, and oh, made me very, very emotional. Um, so I just got to thinking, well, what am I? What are the things that I'm thankful for? And I realized my friends, even though they're not really into Harry Potter, probably some of the most important people that I've ever met in my life and I'm really thankful to have them. And they're so wonderful, and they're so accepting, and they take my Harry Potter obsession in stride. Um, also music, because, you know, it's my career, <laughs> and it just gets me through everything that I need to get through. Uh, and Harry Potter, it's, you know, not only has it been a series for me to enjoy and read and be happy about, it's provided me with this amazing fandom that are just so happy and accepting and wonderful and it's really um, it's a wonderful fandom. Uh, that's all I have time for because I'm running out of time on my camera and so can't wait for tomorrow, Wildcard Wednesday! Bye everybody!